Straight people of Reddit, when did you know you weren't gay? When I was super young I used to take, and sometimes hide, my mom's Victoria's Secret catalogs. I remember an intense feeling while looking at the models in lingerie. It wasn't a horny feeling being so young, but it was exciting, fun and it had a magnetic feeling inside me to look at them. Since I didn't even know what sex is, I figured that feeling was what marriage was. So I'd be flipping pages and I'd be like. I would marry. Her. Wow I really want to marry her. And marry her. I wouldn't marry this one. I love these type of questions that bring back things you never think about. Looking back at this foggy memory I can actually remember the specific perfumey smell the magazines had. That is lovely. I hope you marry the lingerie model of your dreams, and are very happy together. I did something similar but I ended up carefully cutting them out. When asked why, apparently I said I love the curves. When a girl strokes my back or plays with my hair it's very relaxing, I'm like a cat, I am so happy and comfortable and I'll go to sleep. If a guy strokes me or plays with my hair I am tense but in a good way and really excited and flustered and I want to touch him all over. Reading the first half, I thought you were a dude. Took me a minute I thought you answered the opposite question. Me too. My hair was long in middle school, and the people sitting behind me in class always wanted to play with it, it was a thing I guess. When my girlfriend did it, it felt nice. But when the boy did it, I thought he did it so much better. There were two girls in my high school friend group who I, guy, was not interested in because of personality reasons. One of them figured out that I have super soft hair, though, and they decided to play with it. I immediately started reconsidering asking one or both out. I remember being physically attracted to women at a remarkably young age. I don't remember exactly when, but before I had hit puberty. I just sort of knew. I love the way the female body looks. I love the shapes, the curves, the contours. It just felt natural. When I first learned about the concept of being gay, I think I was like 8 to 9 years old. I randomly asked my mom, how do you know if you're gay? And she said, you would just have a feeling and you'd know. I thought about if I've ever felt gay and I didn't, so that was that. That's a very healthy answer to that question. If I had asked my mom that, the answer would have been something like, you'll know because you won't feel God's presence in your life or some such. Gay guy here. Your mom gave you a very intelligent slash sensible answer. I like your mom's smile. I'm bi girl and that was not how it worked for me. I always assumed I was straight because I had liked a couple guys. Then one day, I realized I had a crush on a girl. A few hours later there was the wait, what? Moment and I spent a month questioning my sexuality. I honestly wasn't sure for a while in about 7th grade. It wasn't like I ever really liked boys, but everyone in my class thought I was gay, so it honestly made me question it myself. I was pretty sure I wasn't, but there was always a shadow of doubt until my junior year of high school when I got my first girlfriend. The first time I put my hand down her pants, I'm pretty sure that's when I knew the fuckers in my class were wrong. I was addicted. Edit. To flesh out the story a little more, I really think that this experience helped shape my sexuality in the long run and made me way more tolerant of all kinds of people. I now realize that sexuality is more of a spectrum than a black and white thing, I just happen to be pretty far toward the straight end of the spectrum. Going through that myself made me realize what people who actually are gay or lesbian go through and respect them all the more for it. I got sad as a middle schooler getting harshly rejected by a crush and realized all my guy friends are amazing people to me. So I figured, could I imagine dating them? Couldn't get it up in the slightest. So I quit. I'm pretty sure I'm not gay but Neil Patrick Harris hasn't asked me out so that's an exception. I was joking around with one of my friends and we, my friends and I, asked him how he knew he wasn't gay. He told us he tried it three times and still hated it. He told us the long story about how he gave three dudes blowjobs and then realized he hated it. 
It was so funny. Well, you know, boobies. Exactly this. I realized I am a straight male when I couldn't stop myself from looking at tits at the beach. Of course I would also look at jack dudes and think wow, I want to look like this in the future but opposed to boobs, I would do that consciously. Looking at boobs felt more like an instinct I couldn't control all that much back at age 12. I hate myself for it, but same. Exactly. If horny middle school kids stare at pretty much every boobs to be stared at on the beach it's not because they want to. It just is impossible to control at that age for some reason. I thought I was bi for a while, but I was studying abroad in Spain and this French girl who was openly bi and super pretty was very obviously into me and when we would go to clubs she was all over me and I realized I wasn't into it. It was fun for what it was, dancing and drinking. But I could tell she wanted to take it further and I did not. I also thought I might be bi. Flash forward to eating out the hottest chick I'd ever seen and was like nah. This ain't it. Hell of a time to realize you're actually straight girl. Oh. I've been there. A couple times, just to be sure. It's a weird feeling and you know what I mean but I couldn't describe it to someone who hasn't had our experiences. It's just. Weird. I had the opposite. I'd been struggling with whether I was bi or lesbian and I managed to work it out while doing some guy blowjob and thinking damn I actually don't like this. Pretty much the same story gay people typically say, I've always just known. I've always been fascinated with the female form. I watched gay porn, and I can safely say it wasn't for me. For me it was that scene from X-Men Origins, Wolverine where Hugh Jackman runs naked through a field. I looked at his man butt and thought, oh no, that's definitely not for me. I know the exact scene you're talking about and I feel exactly the same way, man butt is a no-no for me. I was raised in a being gay is a choice type of house. My mom was giving me a speech about how she didn't care if I brought home a black girl, a Chinese girl, whatever, just as long I dated a girl. I was confused about this, and thought to myself, why would I date a guy? I'm attracted to girls. Dating a guy sounds nasty. If I had to date a guy who would I date? Best friend? Ew, no. Preppy guy? Ew, no. What's his name that is out as gay? Ew, no. There's no guy I can even think of that I'd want to be romantically involved with, and even if there was, I'd really have to force myself to do so. Holy shit, being gay isn't a choice. Whenever I hear someone say being gay is a choice, I just assume that person is bi. When I started checking out girls in high school but it would only go as far as thinking they're pretty, no desire to date one. I went to an all-girls school. But I was always thinking about boys. I'm not opposed to treating things with girls if the opportunity came up but I've only ever been sexually attracted to guys or wanting a relationship with one. I do this. I'll see a girl and think she's really pretty and attractive. This physical attraction makes me feel like I would want to have a sexual relationship with a girl but not a romantic one. It's confusing. I'm a straight girl I think and I don't know what to call this feeling. Perhaps romantically you are straight, but sexually you are bi, or bi-curious. Sexuality is a spectrum and for plenty of people something that shifts and changes along the way. You could be straight with a fantasy or hetero-romantic and bi-curious or bisexual or maybe straight with exceptions. And it might all be slightly different three years from now, who knows. In the end labels are only really useful as a shorthand explanation to other people. They're not boxes to fit into. For a while I kind of wondered if I was bisexual, because I can appreciate when a woman looks good, and for a while I was kind of drawn to pictures of naked women. Then I realized that the thought of hooking up with a woman really wasn't a turn on to me, but the thought of hooking up with a guy. Well, elicits a little different response in my body. Turns out I was drawn to images of naked women out of curiosity and for comparing my body to theirs. I just don't get aroused by looking at men, but I do get aroused by looking at women. 
quite literally an image of a woman gives me energy. If they ran a psych experiment and had me stare at images of either gender until I fall asleep, I would fall asleep faster to a picture of a man. Eventually you end up seeing another guy's dick. Whether it's by accident, in porn, etc. And I realized that the only dick in the world I thought looked good was mine. I don't think you really know if you're gay or not until you try it out. My rule of thumb is to try 10 guys, or girls if you're a girl. If you like 6, you're gay. I liked 4. Straight. How do you know that you are not gay? Leave a comment. And subscribe to this channel if you wanna see more same videos.